Oh yeah, Happy New Year, everybody. Hold on now, this thing's got the wrong screen up. Oh wow, it's been so long. Steven Seagal could have fixed it by now, not at his age. <laughs> not at his age, okay? Just not gonna happen at his age. Anyway, so let's just check here real quick. I need to change this because it's got the wrong screen. Boom, boom, boom. What's happening? Cool. Happy New Year. You know this year is halfway already. No, you're, you're weird. You're weird. It's not halfway. Please God, it's not halfway. Anyway, I was saying thank you so much to everybody who's joined us tonight. What's up, Gandalf Sanchez? Ruan, the Boost Week, some new followers. Thanks for the follows. Adam has subscribed. Thank you for the subscription. Really appreciate it. I see we've got some people from Bloom in the house. Welcome, welcome to the Bloom people. So tonight, um, I, I thought a couple of things would, would happen. But then I thought of some other things too. So anyway, basically what I thought was the following. It's too close to Theros to spend all my lovely gold on draft even though man i want to draft some dominaria i love drafting dominaria it was one of the coolest sets for drafting it really was it was good fun um but what i did want to do is i've been having a chat with some people at friday night magics and people have been asking about budget decks decks that don't cost a fortune but that you can have some fun with you know so tonight we're starting with a budget mono green stompy uh, and the deck looks like this. I just love the overcome artwork, so it had to be. Don't talk about stalkers here, but you know what happened last time? We spoke about stalkers. So these are totally BO1 decks. Yeah, they, these are not BO3s, and, and they're not you know massive. But four copies of Wildwood Tracker, four Coral Harpooners, four Leaf Kindreds for some ramp, Wildborn Preservers because they're just freaking cool. They don't cost that much. I mean, Wildborn Preserver uh, is a... 10 buck card so i mean that's really not that expensive so some rabbit bites season of growth thrashing brontodon some yorvos art muscle because it's just that good thorn mammoth because they annoy the crap out of me but they really beat everybody else up and some pain bacon and raise four runners and 22 green lands that's all we really need total price for this deck including the two end raid four runners the two thorn mammoths the three yorvos and the four wild bone preservers is 174 bucks so that's really not that expensive. Um, yes, we do love them mammoths. They kicked my ass when the Brawl decks came out. It's ridiculous. So I ran this deck as a testing. I ran it in some free play BO1s over 30 games. And over 30 games, it came back with a win 18, loss 12 ratio, which I think is not bad. I mean, at one point, we were running 14-3, I think which was pretty good, but we are, the deck is incredibly susceptible to uh, control, um, particularly blue cards, Adam, um, and flash can be a problem, but otherwise the deck is pretty cool. So I thought for the first part of this evening's revelries, we would play a little bit of BO1 and I could show you how the deck works, um, and the day the DJ died. <laughs> <laughs> when Chris mutes himself of excites. I see. It's okay. At least I haven't tried to do anything for 2CMC that isn't possible. Not that it's not possible. Okay? I will find a way. Oh, yes. I will find a way. Anyway. <sighs> also, we've got some news. I don't know if you guys saw the promo that was put out into the group for EGG 6th edition. So that's going to happen in, less, in exactly a month. It's the 7th of day. Sixth edition kicks off on the seventh. No, Andre, this is not vodka. Though it does look like it. I do love this bottle though. I don't know if you guys have seen this stuff before, but it's really, really cool. <laughs> I do like it. Anyway. Um ba -ba -ba -bum. There's gonna be a little bit of an excitementy thing. I just also I wanted to give a shout out to some of the um <laughs> yes, to some of the uh, the prizes that have been added to uh, EGG 6th edition. I mean, some of this stuff is just crazy. So if we can just, first of all, obviously, there's the cruise element, which is just bonkers. But then Leopard's Lair Bush Lodge uh, are offering two nights for two people at Leopard's Lair Bush Lodge, 
Hoodsprit Wildlife Estate, March or April 2020. The owner of the lodge will choose a participant placed below 100 in the tournament. <laughs> Apparently, he's going to pick or she's going to pick on the coolest name. So I suggest you all start figuring out a cool name for yourself. And then from Protea Books and Bloemfontein, one Heroes of Dominaria board game, which I personally would love to get my hands on, two Ultimate Guard Playmat Tubes, which is fantastic, a Theros Bundle, don't quite know what's in that bundle yet, but it's Theros, and we've all been looking at these cards, so it's going to be epic, uh, and five Throne of Eldraine Collector's Boosters. So that's, I mean, that's super cool. Big shout out to the sponsors and to EGG, Adam and EGG, for being able to organize this stuff for the rest of us, you know, players, us, us poor players who simply want to play the game. Yeah, whoop, whoop, bro, dear. <laughs> okay. Midi Chlorianite. What a cool name. I think you're going to win the Leopard's Lodge thing. <laughs> Midi Chlorianite. It's a Jedi magic player. Ooh. All right, but without further ado, does, let's have a look see at what he. This e decky can do e because I must tell you I've been having so much fun playing this deck. Has anybody else noticed that the like client is always looking, waiting for the server, doing stuff like I'm gonna wait for the server, wait for the server, wait for the server. What we are gonna do a little bit later is we're gonna give away. That's right, giveaway time because it's crispy one and EGG and it's sixth edition. We're gonna give away a slot in the tournament. So stick around for that. I'm not keeping that hand. I will keep this hand. <laughs> it's not going to be a raffle. I'm still working out the finer details of how I plan to give that place away because I was told to make it crispy one interesting. So I will. <laughs> Just let me figure out how. You registered already? Okay, so Andre is out of that one. He can't even be involved. Dr. Death has killed his chances of getting a free spot. Yes, killed him. I don't know, Ron. Let's see what happens. I have a plan. I have a way, you know. I got a, I got a thing. I got a way of doing it. Uh, yeah, we're going to keep six. And we'll drop, uh, we'll drop, uh, we'll drop uh, one of those. Because we got a couple of them. And we'll play one of those. We're playing someone named Morgoth. Morgoth? Morgoth. Morgoth. It's Morgoth's cousin who was named by Goofy. Morgoth? <laughs> Morgoth. Yuck, yuck, yuck. <laughs> oh, dear. oh, this is another green boy. Hmm. Season of growth. He's probably going to play some uh, Golgari, I would imagine. Morgoth. Mor no? Still mono green? Okay, so we're up against what looks like mono green. Mono green versus mono green. It's your go, Morgoth. Thought it was into black metal. Okay, it's more girth, maybe. More girth, girth, more girth, more girth. Ah, it's a Buckhead Troll, huh? Hello there, Buckhead Troll. It has been a long time since we saw you. Uh -huh. No, I was not just doing a French accent. I, it's not stuck in my head at all. In any way, whatsoever. Don't know what he's talking about. This is a problem because it can just minus two and become, you know. Hexproof, which is a pain. Oh, I see Ruin is subscribed to our YouTube channel as well. Thank you, Ruin. Uh, Silhana Wayfinder. Okay, so he's going looking for some land. Land, land, land. Wrath, whatever. I've seen you. Well, now attack me with your trolley. I'm not going to block it. No. We're going to draw land. Now we're going to Yorvo your butt. <laughs> Have a Yorvo. Ha ha. <laughs> what you got? What you got? Nothing. I can't hurt my Yorvo. Can't hurt my Yorvo. Because he's a big Yorvo. So I tell you what. We're going to do that. We're going to do that special thing for the place uh, at about, let's say, quarter to nine. Quarter to nine is when we'll do it. We will I'll figure out a way. Is it still saying pre-recorded? Oh my lordy lord lord. It's just so silly. It really is. What a silly thing. There, look, it doesn't say it anymore. It's not pre-recorded. I don't know what you guys are talking about. I never saw anything as pre-recorded. Pre-recorded what? Who pre-records this stuff? 
I don't know. I worked pre-record nothing. So now he's got a giant growth or some other such nonsense to hurt me with. Um, clean slate. Is that like New Year? We get to like start again with our cock-ups. <laughs> Does this mean you'll forget about the 2CMC thing? <laughs> Rot. Never. <laughs> You're a bastard. Um, I say, let's kill something. Draw a card. Cool. But you can do more Garth. More, more Garth. Has anyone been watching this? Uh, what shows have you been watching? Anybody been watching stuff? Watching stuff? I've been watching this new Dracula from BBC. It's so very, very cool. Okay, well, you know. You do that. I'll do this. I can't take an action. Ah. Uh, uh, oh, nothing happened. Oh, look, it's another rabbit bite. Never, never. <laughs> So I'm just never, that's never going away. Is that what you're telling me? That's, that's like one of those, that'll always be there. Witcher, Mandalorian, Vikings, and wrestling. Oh, wrestling. Um, so I watched The Witcher. I thought The Witcher was great. And Dracula is awesome, Papa Man 13. I agree with you 100%. Uh, I am planning to watch the third episode tonight. Um, and it's been good fun. Thank you for following Gandalf Sanchez. Thank you, man. Really appreciate it. Free time is MTGA time. They're not soapies, bro. They're not soapies. Dracula's not a soapy. That's for damn sure. <laughs> I do like this guy they've got playing Dracula. I think he's uh, he's good fun. Um, yeah, I think it's about time we block something. So I tell you what. I'm gonna block there. Wrestling is a soapy, and I play while I want. <laughs> okay, you giant girl. Marlena disapproves. Hashtag days of our lives. <laughs> We're getting a bit pummeled here in our first games. You know, it's one of those things that happens when you stream stuff. <laughs> I'll put down my threshing Baronto Don. The Witcher was good. I enjoyed The Witcher very, very much. I thought, uh, I thought Superman was the perfect, perfect girl. Uh, Henry Cavill. I thought he was absolutely fantastic i thoroughly enjoyed that show um what else have i been watching watching some cool movies too there's a movie called knives out if you haven't watched that i would highly recommend watching knives out it's very very funny um and a really good whodunit it's been a while since we've had a decent whodunit so um it's good to have one again um Dark and Stranger Things on Netflix. Netflix. Stranger Things was great. I thought this third season eh, wasn't quite as good as the others have been, but it was cool. Oh, I knew the swords. I also saw the new Star Wars. Ah. <sighs> we could do a movie discussion about that. In fact, I'll do a movie review. We'll stick it on the YouTube channel. You guys can check it out on uh, the Unnamed Movie Chat Show. But uh, now's out city version of Sun's Out Guns Out. No. <laughs> it's not a Cape Town version of that. No. It's. Uh, it's actually a really cool... I'm not going to attack right now. It's a very cool whodunit. A murder mystery. It's like Cluedo. Very cool. Crazy cast. That is, who's doing pre-release? And where? Ah, oh, yes. The Silhana Wayfinder ploy. Another one. I watched Zombieland Double Tap. <clears throat> that was funny. I thought the first one was better, though. I did like the, the ditzy blonde character. She was funny. She added a new thing. Unplayable. Wow, tall as a beanstalk, huh? That's a lot of damage. Can't take all of that right now. Well, that got rid of that guy. 
you know. Yeah, he's a fairly big boy. No, he's got stuff hiding in here. That worries me. Let's see what he does. Andre and Crispy team up for two headed giant. I would not say no. Sounds like fun. Where would you want to do the two headed giant? I almost said the T headed giant, which would just be the wrong thing to see, right? Oh, look. Of those, is he gonna give it hasty? You gonna come hasty at me? Is he gonna come hasty, hasty at me? I'll kill it, bro. I'll just kill it. The wild born preserver will eat your ceratops, China. Oh, he's doing it. He's gonna give it the hasties. Yeah, bring it. It's gonna die. In the deck somewhere, Andre. I mean, you know. <laughs> We're only running two of them. You know what I mean? It says budget. Remember budget. Cheap. The cheap stuffs. Oh, that's lovely. Look at that. Another one. Another one. Let's go smash him. In. No, what are you doing? Next. Oh, we're attacking with two people. <laughs> Even our leaf can druid is pissed off with our opponent. Take that. <laughs> Crispy one, the only magic player who attacks with zero three creatures. Sounds good, right? I like it. Whatever. <laughs> he almost did exactly the same thing. Yeah, I can kill your only dude who's got damage. Bye. How about we just attack with one guy this time? I would assume my mammoth somewhere in this deck, somewhere in here, in these forty-four cards. He's somewhere. They're, they're somewhere in there. Grah, new green demigod gonna be sweet in this deck. Sure, it's again. Keep in mind, guys, this is totally budget. Eh? I I didn't put any mythics in here. Nothing in this deck. Not a single card in this deck costs more than ten bucks. So Yorvo is nine bucks seventy two, Wildborn Preserve is nine bucks forty five. So I, I I went specifically for the idea of making sure that you could afford to play this deck. Is it uncommon? Fantastic. We likes uncommons. Let's flash this guy in. Let's see what's next. We don't need another land. Let's get a creature. Come on. That'll do. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five. Well, one, two, three, four. Let's go three for now, just in case. Add card bot to your chat. I do a card bot. Oh, we got pain bacon coming. Um, I have thingamabobby. I have a thingamabobby <laughs> that allows you to see my deck and stuff, but uh, I forgot to activate it tonight. But I will check out Cardbot. Cardbot sounds cool. What does Cardbot do? I think unless he blocks that game. Boom, bam. I got this one. Stream Decker. Stream Decker deck thing. But it never seems to work so well. Every time we put it up and said it's running, it doesn't actually do anything. Uh, as far as I know. Okay, so we're just going to scare the bejesus out of our opponent on our next turn and drop Pain Bacon. You can link the card in chat. I see now that's cool. Oh, that! Okay, cool. So then if you mention a card or cards, 
people can check them out straight away. That's actually very cool. Yeah, man. I will check that out this week. Boom! So there's a win. Although we didn't get to play our Pain Baker. Super J just subscribed with Twitch Prime. Why, thank you, Super J. Dude, how goes the prep for the Mythic? If you're there, Super J. How goes the prep? A couple of our boys are in Mythic Championships. Invi uh, trying to head for the Invitationals. Which I think is fantastic. Yeah, I didn't even see the Pain Maker. Pain Maker. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> this is the Pain Maker. Because uh, <laughs> we are Halal. And kosher, and uh, just generally everything. <laughs> so who's who's in the mythic? We've got we've got Bob Perfect in mythic, Shaq's in in mythic, Super J's in 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 mythic. You've decided on your deck. You want to you want to? Oh, oh, this is nice. We will keep that. Um, give us an idea, Super J, Jamie. You want to tell us uh, what you what you're thinking of running? That'd be cool. I'd love to know. As plebs who don't make mythic. Shaq, Bob, Cora, Jamie, Scant. That's awesome. Five people. That's amazing. Congratulations to all of them. I think that's totally, totally fantastic. So I want to get that down so we can start getting some scrides going on and then just swing in for one. These decks are kind of interesting. If I'm, if I'm right, this is going to be the life gain deck. Yeah, there we go. But that's all good because we have ways. We have ways. Let's do this. You know, uh, Ricardo and Tience as well. Awesome. That's really, really awesome. Um, do I want, I think. One, two, three, four, five. We're going to have pretty good mana. I'd rather. Let's try and find another creature. Jeskai Walker Fires. Hey, okay. Sounds good. Let's attack. We've got another creature on the board. Will he trade with the Pride Mate? That's the question. Keep the pressure up. That's what we do with mono green. Keep the pressure up. That's how it goes. Yeah, oh, geez. So then we draw another one anyway. Okay. So I tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna drip, drip, drippity drop the preserver, which gives it. Ah, there's our boy. There's our boy. Then we're gonna drop this, which gives us a trigger on that to make it a three-three, so we can block. That dude, should he come through? It doesn't matter. We can resolve that. No problem. We get the scry on Yorvo again. And then we keep up the pressure by swinging in with the tracker. Just guy Walker fights. Okay, so for those of you who don't know, you need to check out Super J's channel as well. Uh, he is at twitch.tv superj36. So absolutely check him out. His stuff is cool. And he's... Good. Let's do that. And then that, because that will trigger that nicely. We'll take action for two. And another Yorvo, which we can ditch. And then we will swing, swing. Yeah, that works for me. I don't mind trading the Harpuna. I must tell you, the Crawl Harpooner has become a seriously cool card, in my opinion. Boom, there we go. It's another win. That's two tonight so far. I'm loving it. I'm loving it. Just got a walk of fires, huh? Shaq, Bob, Cora, Jamie, Scant, Ricardo, and Tience. That's amazing. One, two, three, four, five. See my maths. Seven peeps. That's really, really cool. Jamie, I'd offer to help you out on the playtesting and stuff, but two things. First of all, you'd kick my ass too easily. And secondly, I have work. Because it's that New Year thing happening again. Anywho. I'm trying to figure out how we give this place away. On. On. For 6th edition. I'll figure it out. Let's go. Let's go one more. Let's go another one. Let's go another one. Who's enjoying this deck? Are you liking this deck? Tell me. Let me know. I think it's a very cute deck. It's fun. I enjoy playing it. Next Monday will be the last day we see fires and standards dominating champions like Oko did. You think so? You think we're going to hit another 
2020, banning things like 2019. Let them answer a tricky MTG based question. <laughs> Can you? <laughs> Can you legions end a risen reef? No, you see, that's not a real question. Again, we'll keep this. That's a cool hand. Boom, boom. Traffic, yeah. Ah, you see, I beat you to it. I beat you to it. <laughs> yeah, we're just going to drop this now. Good. I'm so glad you guys like the deck, man. I will post the deck into the Discord. Uh, as well, and I'll pump out the link. Fibble Thip. Damn, I hate that card. Damn, get damn, I hate that card. But I'm gonna do this. Yeah, no, we're just gonna decline. But then we're gonna attack with everything. Die, Fibble Thip, die. Okay, you see, now you're just asking silly questions. Very silly questions. No one should ask those kinds of questions. Those are the kind of questions. That people shouldn't ask. Let's get rid of Fibble Thip. Cool, I don't mind that. We get to draw and. Wabamo, go, 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 go. Block something. Take some damage. Hey, these guys. They, you know, it's like. It's like it's written on my skin. <laughs> Written on my skin. It's like, these are the boo-boos you made in 2019. How would you like to relive them? I know. Let's do it every Tuesday and Thursday in chat. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! No, but it's okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine, you know. Love you guys. Love you all. It's just, just the way it is. I'll kill you. I ain't magic, but I love you. <laughs> oh, dear. Interesting magic question here. Hey? I don't know if I want to ask it. How about a magic related question? Okay. Although, that's fairly simple. Opponent, it is your go, Trafik. Is that like a Rafik, but someone who drives a lot? Trafik. EGG related? Okay, so now, now you're just confusing me even more. What do you think of Theros being Simic? Ah? Ah. This is my... Not sure what you say. Our opponent is hate rage quit. Let's hello him. Hello. <laughs> hello. It's your go. <laughs> Pulling a canister. <laughs> Maneuver here. Ah, screw it, let's just do this. Stomp in there, break him apart. Let's see, we're gonna take action here for three. And just destroy our opponent's hopes and dreams. Simic is gonna be out of control. Go on, block the 2 2. Stupid Flash is aggravating enough. <laughs> Flash can be. I mean, there are ways around Flash. Just gotta get under them. Gotta get under them. EGG that way they can't Google. Oh no, I got a, I got a cool, I got a cool question, but it's, it's very much hit and miss. Very much hit and miss. And then some people are gonna get the right answer, and some people aren't. Then I'm gonna have to, like, randomly find a way of selecting who it is. Yeah, our opponent is definitely rage quit on us, but that's okay. That's three wins in a row for us. Happy with that. Happy with this little deck. I think it's very cool. It's good fun. Next one we're going to do is a little mono red thing. Also, again, budget, but that'll be Thursday night fun. We'll be having some mono red for Thursday night. Uh, and then Tuesday next week, I think we'll do some blue. <coughs> Sorry. <laughs> uh, do some of that color. Adam's color, the color of evil, and uh, after that we'll get back to some proper magic, <laughs> like white and black, sorry did I put a little bit of emphasis on that, black, anyway, 
Here we go, game four. Uh, I'm actually just buying time and trying to figure out how to ask this question right now because it's one of those things where I really want to make it not too easy. Okay, I actually, I've got to, I've got to. Hmm. Well, this is an interesting hand. It's some big damage and a rabbit bite and all that stuff. I think we may keep this. We'll keep it. This creatures. And we all agreed. The hell we Oh. Anyway. One of those things. Yeah, I see. I try to like go and like look for a question. Okay, I got a way of doing it. I have a way of doing the question. Okay. Adam, obviously you're not allowed to, you know, take part. No offense. So I can drop a crawl harpooner next turn. Before yeah, you see, this is good. I'm happy to trade if you come at me. I will trade for your pelt collector, dude. Yeah, no, we don't like pelt collectors around here. And look at that. Let's do this. What you got now? Hey, Feng has fanged off. Okay, so we will. I'll wait for quarter two, ten minutes from now. But I figured out exactly how I'm going to do this question thing gonna be gonna be interesting um, let's just uh, let's keep going oh, or should we spend 5k and do some Dominaria I did love Dominaria in limited hey man it's first week back of work giveaway question <laughs> you're funny it's not quarter two Quarter two. Yes, we will keep this. Ba, 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 ba. Oh, in case you've noticed, some of you may have noticed that there's no music. And the reason for that is because I would like to start pushing these out onto YouTube. And I'm not able to do that if I run the Spotify soundtrack in the background. So let's do this. We can turn the music, Magic the Gathering music, way back up again. And then you can have some tunes in the background, at least. Free Hong Kong. From who? Didn't didn't Hong Kong go back to the Chinese or something? What? Who does it need to be freed from now? He <laughs> also somewhere around it. Oof. Huh? I'm confused. Let's put that down. Will he trade? Will you trade your paradise druid? Bam, no. Okay. I love this card. I must tell you, I love everything about the music problem. Really? What, what's the way around that? Oh, I know th what's going on here. I know what's going on here. Really? You're going to kill that? Okay. No worries. We're going to do this. We're going to do that. And we're not going to attack because you've got your flipping death touchy thing. The music problem, really? The Bushwick seems to... You seem to have all the answers, man. You seem to know what's going on. Vivian, really? Yeah, I know. This is... This is... Uh, this is... What's his name's deck, man? This is Mono Black Magic's deck. He's death touch nonsense. Not just the mythic Vivian Okbo Ranger, which we can't put in our budget deck. Yeah, okay. Die. Record all the channels on their own. Okay. Sounds good. And we're just quickly going to kill Vivian here. 
Yeah, man. Thank you. That sounds like good advice. I'd love to be able to do that. Shifting Ceratops comes in. No worries. Can't give it haste, but is going to hit me with the Death Touch Boiky. No blocks. All good. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to do that. Darn it, should have done it the other way around. But this will do the trick nonetheless. Let's get in there for some damage. No, we needed the rabbit bite. We needed the rabbit bite to take out the death touch pookie faced bastard. It's okay, we got we got some of this going on here. That's fine, attack me with that, that's brilliant. I'm really not gonna block it. <sighs> we could be in trouble here. We need a rabbit bite. If we get a rabbit bite, we're in the pound seats. That is not a rabbit bite. However, this will work. Simply because Yorvo becomes indestructible. Indestructible, baby. Lose a land or lose a Nissa. Bing, bang, bop. Cheers, thanks for coming. Yes, it does. That's right. Out muscles go. Oh, hello. Okay, that's fine. Um, we we'll kill the land. Our opponent is too reliant on big things what don't do much. Let's first make Yorvo a little bit bigger, then make him really big and indestructible. <laughs> and then let's win. I love this deck! Is Ansha being she's being mean to you in the admin tournament? Oh, they're getting there. I had, I had to take a big break. I wasn't allowed to do any work-related stuff over the holiday, Jamie. <laughs> I got banned from doing work stuff. I'm doing badges, my man. Proper classic badges. They're going to look really cool. Uh, I just need, again, just a little bit of time to get them sorted out. Hopefully get them sorted out before the end of next week. And then you get your subs badges going on. No, I don't, we'll call them emotes, but, uh, but I'm going to call them badges. What's the time? Okay, we've got four minutes. Four minutes. Say dunk. Say Douglas Eddie 23 hashtag deck. What does that mean? Why are we saying that, Douglas? Apparently, Adam was mean today with his Hydra deck. <laughs> yes, I, I got yours. Yours are cool, man. Yours are very cool. Uh, yeah, we're going to keep this. This is good. This is a good hand. Have I tried Mono Green Stomp in Modern? I actually don't play Modern. Um, I just, uh, yeah, I, just, I don't play Modern. I actually very rarely play Standard. I play Standard in Arena and in things like, like the things we do. Just to see the deck you were playing looks cool. Ah, oh, thanks, Douglas. It is cool. I will I'll pop it back up for you again. Uh, in fact, you know what we'll do? Let's do this. Let's find... I'm not too worried about our opponent right now. Doing stuff. Coming at me with a... I'm just going to block that. Why should I take the one? There we go. Let's do this. And should we scare the crap out of him? Uh, no, let's just kill him. Let's just kill him, right? Because we can do this. But we don't want to kill him. Because then he comes back as a life linky linky winky.
Whatever, you can have the live linky winky. That's fine. Uh, yeah, so we played the PTQ and stuff. Um, my favorite format is Commander. That's that's what I like to play. I like I love I loves me love loves me some Commander. I do, yeah. But why is there is there is there a mono green stomp modern deck that I might like? What's time? Almost time. Almost time. Almost time. Dun 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 dun. Hold on a sec, just gotta run this up here. Cool. Okay, so in here, if we want deck lists, let's quickly. Oh, I'm so confused right now. Okay. What the hell just happened? Are we losing? No. Okay, good. <laughs> What's this? Conclave Guild Mage? I know them. Um, I just, I feel like doing it just because I can. Budget also and fun, able to be the best. Cool, man. I'm always keen for Mono Green Stomp. Mono Green Stomp has been one of my favorite. My favorite. Uh, there he goes, and he's dead. You can block him, but it's not going to help you. Okay, so for those of you who are interested, that is the Discord channel. There are some deck lists there, including this one. I've just put that in there now. And that's it. No more creatures for you on the battlefield. Eh? No more creatures. It's terrible. It's very sad. Conclave trouble. You see my wildborn preserver. That's just rude, man. That's okay, though. You know why? It's okay. Because you should have stolen that. <laughs> okay, after this game, we're doing the question. It's question time. It's question time here on twitch.tv forward slash crispy one. Question time for a free place in Easy Gaming Group MTGA's 6th edition tournament. I'll be asking a very simple question. The question is a yes or no answer. And the first person to give me the correct answer will get the place in the tournament. So it's pretty easy. Have you Silver Bill? Silver Bill? Silver Bill? Ha no, no, I haven't asked the question yet. <laughs> you may only give one answer. You may only give one answer. There is no maybe. Adam, you may not answer. <laughs> there is no maybe. There is do or do not. There is no try. See all these yes noes, eh? Silver Bear has uh, rage. Why do the people's rage quit? Eh? They play the game. They don't play the game. Do you come to play or do you come to quit? Anyway, it is all fun and dandy. Jamie and Anshin either. Why? What? Are they already in? Okay. So who's already registered? Okay. Let's put it this way. If you have already registered. Please don't answer the question. <laughs> if you haven't registered, you may answer the question. Okay, so now we got stuff. Okay, our opponent is seriously buggered off. He's going to go make coffee or sleep with his sister or whatever it is that he's doing. Jeez, luck! Did I just say that? Oh my word. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> His name is Suvabu, huh? Suvabu. <laughs> yeah, no, he's gone. Okay. <laughs> Alrighty, here it is. Ch -ch 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 
That's not a bad run though, hey? What's that, five wins on the trot? It's a nice little deck, this worm. We like it. Okay. Acclaimed Magic Gathering. No. Okay, here's the thing. Alexi Bricklot is an acclaimed Magic the Gathering artist. The question is, very simply, first person who's not already registered to give the correct answer, either yes or no, will be the winner. Okay? No, no, you haven't. Heard. Cookies, yes. Has Alexia Bricklight ever played a game of Magic the Gathering? <laughs> uh, Andre, you got it. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> no, he hasn't. He's not ever actually played a proper game. Um, he got into it because he liked the artwork. He sat down with some cards and sort of throwing them around. But he has admitted to me in an interview we did at Comic Con Africa that Alexi Bricklot has not won a game, not actually played a game of magic. That's pretty weird, right? So, Ashen, you got in there with a no. So, I believe Lin2904, you is our winner. Winner, winner, Lin2904. Adamantium, there is your, there is your person. Yeah, and you cooked our meat. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh my word. She can't have it? Well then it's gotta be Ruan. She's co host. Well there you go then. She can't have it. Ruan the place is yours. English Papa Man, a little late there, buddy. <laughs> Nice try, though. Okay, so, Adam, there you go. Ruan00713 is the winner of A Place in EGG 6th Edition. Congratulations, dude. Well done. Well done for getting... The, you're having your finger on the buzzer. What's my vault progress? I'm 132%. So I'm hoping that with the... That and all of those... And that... I'll be able to vault so much as well. And we'll get some vaulty stuff. Come here, Sacco 007. We like it. Sacco 007. Can't we just call you Ruan? Or it's just Psycho. Do we have to add the number at the end? It's the number that takes long to say. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, damn. Okay. All right. Also, we're going to... I tell you what, we're going to do one more game. One more game. And then, Did I buy both bundles, High Priest? No, dude. I, uh, I bought... I just bought the 50 pack thing. I wasn't gonna buy it. I can't afford it. <laughs> Are you mad? No, I couldn't afford it. Not a chance. Uh, I just bought the 50 pack thing. I did get the very cool Ashiok sleeve though. I did get the cool Ashiok sleeve. Uh, okay, cool. <laughs> yes, we, Andre, we know you did it. You, Papa Bear 13. <laughs> I win! I win! <laughs> <laughs> I have also discovered that Telcom is nicer to me if I keep the streams shorter. So, that's, that's kind of how it works. Of course you got both bundles. I mean, really? Like you wouldn't get both bundles. Anyway. Some people out there just have far too much, you know. Either they have nothing else to spend their money on, which is totally possible. And nothing wrong with that. Or they just have too much money. Um, sure, why not? This might be the worst hand we've kept all night. So we keep the streams down to like an hour from now on. That way I can definitely stream all month long without having Telcom shout at me and slow me down and cut me off and all that kind of stuff. It also means that I get to take the episode and the stream and turn it into a cool thing to go up on the YouTubes, which is always fun. So, you know, it was Christmas. Someone had to get me a gift, so you did. Oh, did you guys see the gifts my kids gave me? I got a... I got a I got a, I got a, I got a Fate Reforged fat pack and a Magic Origins fat pack. I was so stoked. It was very, very cool. 
I was a very happy guy. I was so happy. <laughs> uh, Hello, opponent. Um, should we just do it? I'm gonna open the fat packs on stream, dude. I already opened the fat packs. You think I have willpower? Are you mental? I'm just, what? Code monkey, seriously, dude. I had a fat pack from Fate Reforged, and I had a fat pack from Origins. I opened those things. Too sweet, my friend. Too sweet. I managed to last like a day. <laughs> Put this deck, put this deck on stream decker. Yeah, sure, I will do that. No worries. Uh, give me one second. I'll do it straight after this. Oh look, it's Teferi. What's up, Teferi? You gonna bounce somebody? Go ahead, bounce him. All good. All good, my Teferi friend. I'll do it straight after this match, Harpies. No worries. Oh, look who it is. <laughs> yeah, no, I opened them and I got my Nissa, man. I was looking for the for the Origins Nissa, the legendary creature that flips into the Planeswalker, and I got that, so I'm very happy. Got some other cool stuff too, obviously. Well, not obviously, but I got some other cool stuff. Uh, I now have. Uh, 10 cardboard boxes about yay long and yay wide with magic cards in them. <laughs> Thanks, Papa Man. I really appreciate it, dude. Uh, come back on Thursday. We'll get more crazy and do some more weird stuff. Next turn, Rabbit Bite the Teferi. I can't. <laughs> Don't make me do stuff. I can't do. Oh, look, it's Gadwick. Hello, Gadwick the Wizened. Mmm. So what we can do, we can out muscle. Viewer challenges on Thursday, says Adam. Only if EGG sponsors whatever freaking mythics I need to buy to be able to be a challenge. <laughs> so we're gonna do this. Draw a card. Do that. Do this. See if he blocks. The Hydras are hungry. Shut up. You'll... I remember the first time you played your Hydras against me, dude. You scared the bananas out of me. I almost gave up magic. <laughs> Come on, Exoreth. Exoreth. Exo. Riathras and Snurf. There we go. Hi. Boom, ba boom, 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 ba boom. Always keeping cards in hand. I don't like it when they do that. Oh, he's opting. In the beginning of my turn, and he's going to tap the Wild Wood Tracker. That's fine. Oh, did Ruan get him earlier? <laughs> cool. <laughs> oh, dear. Yeah, okay, you, you do that. You tap that, tap that guy, you tap him. Bio Essence 27 to, oh jeez like. Jeez like. Which planes, which walkers did you have on the board at the time? Okay, so next turn, we're going to Mammoth all over Gadwick. Oh! Oh! Oh, that could be very interesting. <laughs> A voracious twenty-one, twenty-two. You see, you shouldn't. You just shouldn't be able to do that. It's just not fair. You know, Nissa, Kiora, and Teferi. Yeah, well, there you go. It's the Teferi part that annoys me. Do we try it? Do we see if? I mean, I'm pretty sure he's going to counter this, right? He's going to counter us. Am I right? Five, six, seven. So what we could do? Yeah, no. Paul Bester 
pain bakened me to death to like minus 67 or something the other day. He was like, hey, Crispy, do you want to have a quick game? I was like, yeah, sure, man, let's play. And then he like raped me. <laughs> Just so mean. <laughs> I want to try this. Oh, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. Undo that. Whatever, let's see. He's going to counter it. Of course he's going to counter it. If he doesn't, he's a fool. Yeah, cool. No worries. But what he doesn't know is we have another one. He got Rashawn to a minus 134. Oh my gosh. What the heck? You know. It's just, it's poor. You know, he wears that like smiley, innocent, you know, happy face. And then he does these terrible things to people. Oh, I have a very cool idea. I'm going to attack you with him and you're gonna go but why would you do that I'm gonna say well because he becomes a 3-3 three, three. fine bye Gadwick oh look at that Done. Yeah, 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 yeah. Crack that fable passage. I'm scared to play this other thorn mammoth now because he's just gonna count it, and I want to put my big elephant on the board. But he's got to play something. I'm gonna start smashing him in the face. Attack with the druids. See what happens here. Bushwick, thank you so much for joining in, man. Really appreciate it. Thanks for the follow. Thanks for the chat. Really, really, yeah, no, it's been good, man. Have a good evening. And yes, we'll chat soon. I'd love to find out about your tricks, the tricksinesses. That'd be cool. Uh, I'm going to end the turn. And we'll flash in the Wildborn Preserver on our next turn. If he lets us. I'm hoping he counters it. I'm hoping he counters it. That's fine. Question is what you're gonna bounce. Wildwood tracker, right? No problem. I can't do it, Captain! Damn it, that Teferi is an asshole! I told you, control was something we did not do well against. Ah. ah! My Nico Bolas voice comes out. Oh. Whatever. I hate you. I hate you, Teferi Time Reveler. You suck. Suck piles. Horrible piles. The kind that need medication of the worst kind. Lost all our mammoths. Is, 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 is. All two of them, we've lost them. Hey, let's see what happens. <laughs> Good. Counter that. Yay. Counter this. 
Ha, I'm the one friend in your list. <laughs> Well, good. Now we we got to do stuff. Ah, <sighs> boy, you're the one friend in my list. Which list is that, High Priest? Which list? Robin. I'm confused. Oh really? <laughs> What's up, high priest? <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> Why would you do that? Ah, I saw it. I got it. I got it. Go on, veto that. Oh, there they are. <sighs> it was a good... It was a good day. Really? Planar cleansing, huh? Who the duck? Who runs planar cleansing in free play? Seriously, who runs planar cleansing in free play? Clearly this guy does. What a twist, right? <laughs> totally. What a twist. <laughs> well, counter that. I can't even play it. Now I'm annoyed. Now I'm annoyed now. Yeah, no, I'm that. Yeah. Go away, planar cleansing asshole. Seriously, we're in free play. What are you doing with a planar cleansing? It's our first loss of the night. It's terrible. It comes as the last game. It's terrible. Sucks, sucks, sucks. Anyways, okay. So hold on. I got to do something here. I got to go like this. I got to go here. I got to go export. And then I got to go home. And then I got to go to... Wait, I've got it here somewhere. Hold on. We go stream... Open that folder. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, that's right. I got to make like a listy list. So let's file new. V file save as MTGA, MTG deck lists, arena stream decker. And it's going to be mono green. Mono green budget and it's a text document, save it. Okay, and then we gotta go to this app. Hold on y'all. One second. Where did it go? Nah. Okay, high priest, I will stick this deck up straight after I close everything down. It's just too much of a schlep to go looking for that. Uh... Hold on. Hold on. There's a way to do this. Ta-da. Okay, I'm getting there. I'm getting there. I'm sorry this is taking long. It's one of those things. People ask, I must deliver. That's how this works. Isn't that how this works? We go work so that I can take the day to help Jamie tomorrow. Thanks for the lucky stream, Crispy. Cheers, boys. Cheers, Adam. Thank you so much, dude. It's always, always fun. Okay, my decks. I want to upload new. Yeah, yeah. And then I want to. Where has it gone? 
Steam Deck. There it is. Mono green budget. Boom. There you go, High Priest. It is up. It is up. It is up. I should have changed the name to Best of One. Change the name to Best of One. Can we edit? Yes. B O One. There we go. It's definitely a BO1 deck. It's not it's not meant for anything else, really. But there you go, High Priest. It's up there. Everybody, I'd just like to say thank you so much for watching. It's been an absolute blast being with you all this evening. We'll be back on Thursday. And if you're keen, we can maybe try some of that uh, viewer challenging. How about that? We do some viewer challenges on Thursday, um, just for, for shits and giggles. And then Tuesday, we'll be back with another, another mono budget. Another mono budget deck. But until then... Loves and kisses to everybody. And a happy new year. And I hope 2020 is going to kick ass for all of you. I think, uh, I'm feeling it's going to be a good year. But uh, yeah, thanks you all. Thanks so much for watching. Really appreciate the support. Keep supporting local streamers. It's a good way to go. It's a good thing to do. It'll make you warm and fuzzy inside. Yeah, anyway. Until then, Ruan, congratulations on your win. And uh, I'll see you all again on Thursday. Thank you so much for watching. Good night, y'all. <laughs>